Hey everyone, Best in West here, and today um, I'm doing something that I should, probably should have done a long time ago. I'm putting a screen protector for my Wii U gamepad. Um, the gamepad itself is pretty expensive, and so any damage to the screen would probably cost a lot. So today I got this Hori screen protector for the gamepad. Um, I read some reviews online, and they said that this is probably the best one. So I bought this on Amazon and I got it so I'm going to be doing a quick installation or maybe not such a quick installation I'm not sure yet I never installed it yet but it seems like a pretty simple installation so let's go okay so first thing that you will want to do is make sure your the screen on your gamepad is very clean so how I did it is I used a microfiber cloth. Um, you can use it for the microfiber cloth that comes with your glasses. That's what I'm using. Or there are several other ones that you can use. But pretty much you want to just wipe it down. Make sure that dust and grease and fingerprints and stuff like that aren't, aren't existent on your um, gamepad screen. Another way to do it, it, another thing I use is like some of the solution that you use for your glasses. If you don't have this, you know, you can probably use... Um, water, but this is probably probably the best thing that you can use. Okay, so after I sprayed that on my gamepad and I wiped it down, I also have some condensed air. Oh crap! Anyways, I have some condensed air, and I just sprayed it to make sure that you know all the dust from the corners is gone, making sure that it's clean. So once I stick the the screen protector on, that there's no there's no air bubbles caused by the dust and stuff that will be stuck on there forever. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so I'm going to be unwrapping this this uh, this uh, screen protector. Screen filter. Precision screen filter by Hori now. Okay? So in the back, it seems that you have a little flap right here. So you can open that up right here. Pull that out and throw that to the side. Open it up. You have an insert with some instructions on it. All right. And here it appears that you have the screen protector. And this is what I believe is to use to get make sure that you apply it nicely. One, two, three, four. Okay. Alright, so we're going to start applying it now. Okay, so right here I have the screen filter. And how they want me to apply it, according to the instructions, is pull off this, uh, this number one tab, place it on the screen, and then make sure that it's positioned correctly on the screen. Once it is, it'll, it'll have some adhesive on the back. Once that's affixed, I hold that portion, pull this side, apply some pressure on it to uh, connect it with that side. After that, pull this. Uh, do the same thing on this side. Pull this, and then the screen filter should be attached. If there's still some air bubbles in it, I will use this to get the air bubbles out of it. All right, so I'm gonna wipe it down one more time and blow it off with some air to make sure that there's no dust. My room is a little bit dusty, so I don't want any dust to cause any air bubbles or anything but there is um, some information on how to get the dust particles off your screen after the after the screen filter has been applied but it's easier <laughs> if you we don't have to go that route so let's hope I don't have to do that so take this off there is some adhesive right there so I'm going to place it about right all right it says to hold it actually that is not right I do not like the position of that make sure that's on the corners 
I can go down almost can go down all right so that's there now it tells me to pull this number two slowly Seems pretty good so far. Next one, do the same thing. Number three. It kind of just went on by itself. I don't know if you guys saw that, but the shadow kind of just pushed it on itself. So the adhesive that I initially tore off is on the is on this number three piece. So that adhesive isn't actually sticking to the screen. Alright, so I think I got that done. Now it tells me a pull off number four. So here we go. And ta-da. That is pretty good. Um, I'm actually surprised as to how easily that went on. There's some small dust specks. And I'm kind of... Oh, nope, never mind. That comes off. Um, there's some small dust specks, but it's nothing that I can't live with. Um, so, yeah. Looks pretty good. Now, so if I were to use my... Yeah, it definitely is a lot smoother. You might like it, you might not, but it'll definitely protect my screen. All right. Okay, so that was a little unwrapping and installation of the Hori Precision Screen Protect Screen Filter. Um, it was pretty easy to install, and I'm sure that it is going to protect my screen very well. So if you guys have any questions about this product or how to install it, please leave it in the comments. Make sure you like this video, and thanks for watching, guys. Catch you guys later.